They say the time of heroes is over. That if you're different, you're dangerous. But I know the truth. The world will always need heroes. We just need to reassemble. Never meet your heroes? Well... I did. And it was awesome! The Avengers were everything I imagined. Hello, San Francisco! Thor. Tony, check it out. At once. Try to keep up. This just got a whole lot more interesting. Let's make this quick. Secure the bridge. Those weapons can't get into the city. Are you set them up? File, knock them down. Thor, what's your status? There are humans trapped, and lots of small, angry men with guns. Is that a joke? Did Thor make a joke? Cat, they got pulsar tanks. All the murderers. Do the Avengers pose a danger to society? That was the question, Bruce. That was the question. Well, we all lost something that day. But that's not how this story ends. What are we waiting for? Oh, damn it! Progress, Hank! I have a plan, but it's risky. Hank? That doesn't look ready. Come on, Tony, live a little. Unbelievable. It worked. It's sort of cute when they're small. Ah, I didn't touch you for a second, Hank.
What is your name? Kamala Khan. I was just some weird kid from Jersey who didn't fit in. I kind of stole something off of AIM's server. Huh? <laughs> what? Why? Why? AIM calls people like me inhuman. He claims we're sick, violent. He says our disease will kill us in the end. Well, I don't believe it. What if the Avengers were set up? AIM, the so-called cure, it's just not lining up. There's something wrong and I can feel it. Don't you? The kid is inhuman. We did this, and she needs your help. I, I can't. I can't. You can't what? You're ditching me? Hey, don't take it personally, kid. No, this is what he does. <laughs> this was a mistake. So you're both just gonna walk away? The Avengers were set up. Cap was murdered. You think I don't know that? I've replayed that day in my head a thousand times. Guess what? No one cares. The world needed someone to blame, and he gave them their scapegoat. So, unless you have some kind of astounding proof, I suggest you both get off my land. What is that? Proof. Is an entrance. I was just some weird kid from Jersey who didn't fit in. The kid is inhuman. We did this, and she needs your help. People believe in the Avengers. We can't just sit around and do nothing. Isn't the thing you are. It's the thing you do. Overnight, the world changed for everyone. We're working from home setups, kits, everything they need. But these new challenges have fueled our passion for the mission. Our mission to fulfill our promise to you. Here we got her hand slamming against the wall. To finish what we started. Uh, it's about shot composition and... To reassemble uh, the Avengers. Up until this point, what we see of Kamala is... We're reminded every day how important it is to connect. Because whatever the mission, we can accomplish it together. Together, we are smarter. Resilient. Determined. Mighty. Brave. Unstoppable because we are stronger together. of his, they harvest their powers through the torture of these inhumans. Georgie Boy is gearing up for war. Programmable power under our control. No more heroes. The entire world is in terrible danger. Time is here. I could pull some strings to spruce up the armory. Get ourselves some new toys to play with. Dangerous ones. I'm picking up something in the atmosphere. A derivative of Terrigen. 
I'm here. Who needs their ass kicked? Very end. Reach dark magic. <laughs> We gotta get this bird in the air before AIM comes looking for us. Jarvis is unencrypting the schematics and we'll get our tech heads on new gear ASAP. Look at all this. Which nation state is AIM planning to go to war with? Heroes are people, and people can be corrupted. If I don't stop them, it's just one more thing to regret on my deathbed. In times like this, it all seems hopeless. That's when we've got to stand strong. You want to see powers? Here we go. Time for heroes is over. You don't get to decide who lives or dies! Hey! Where did this thing come from? Young, I found an orphaned wolf cub in the forest behind our farm. I felt if I could instill rules, the proper boundaries, I could harness the raw power of that beast. A few months later, while hunting, the adolescent cub turned on me. We're fixing the damage the Avengers did all those years ago. Inhumans are sick. Unlimited power, that's dangerous. It's lethal. You are lucky to be alive. Come on, Kamala. Let AIM help you. I'll take my chances. What if the Avengers were set up? I think you should see for yourself. Mr. Stark help us with this? Hi, I'm sorry. Who are you? Uh, Kamala? This better be good. He totally locked Captain in the reactor room and then he tried to jack the Chimera. Son of a... Have you all completely lost your senses? What? Where were you while the world went to hell? This is our fault. All of ours. You really think the world is better without us? Yes. See, it's always been your problem. Yes. Running from who you are, what you are. I am To any surviving Avengers. Should we lose the fight ahead of us? Should everything be lost, then know this. The key to saving our future lies in the past. Clint? Well, I... Guess that explains the shock arrow. And the bow. And the sea of emotions.
played that day in my head a thousand times. The Avengers take the fall despite saving the day. We failed him. I believe that we are dangerous. There's still a bad guy out there who wants to hurt the world. You're already a hero. The only one left to convince is yourself. We can stop him. Yeah, now we're talking? All units, find the girl. People believe in the Avengers. Your differences are your greatest superpower. No matter how bad things get, you always come together. Aren't you gonna say the thing? What? Avengers Assemble. Avengers, good. There's someone who wants to talk to you. I believe some of you know Kate Bishop. Oh, we've met. Are you working for S.H.I.E.L.D. now? It's, uh, complicated. Where's Clint? That's complicated, too. Clint and I were looking into what happened to Director Fury after A-Day. We stumbled on this Tachyon project, and then Clint was gone, too. That. Our guest finally agreed to help. Remember what's riding on this. Easy, Doc. Deal's a deal. I'll do my part. Clint? We need to destroy that place. Now! No. Okay, how's this? I am Thor, God of Thunder. That is not what I sound like. First rule of beaming, always look good doing it. There are numerous ways to beam an enemy. I, obviously, choose the coolest one. As I say to my team, you don't always have to aim for the face. But I highly recommend it. Did I mention I can fly? Remember, every landing is a chance to make a statement. Mine says, I'm done flying now, and I would like to come down. I am Iron Man. Welcome to my superior seminar. This looks awesome. I want to play this. It's going down. Thank you. 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 Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Fellow Avengers, thank you. Gracias. To all the Avenger fans, whoever you are, wherever you are. Thank you.
Some people just need a high five. To the face. With a giant hand. I'm gonna show you how to make your hand approximately 45 times bigger than it is. Turns out, you don't have to be near someone to punch them. Having a positive attitude is a great way to contribute. That and having hammers for hands. I'm Miss Marvel. Welcome to my superior seminar. I'll try, but if I don't... Nope, not having that conversation. You know we thought you were dead. Nobody heard from you. I was just some weird kid who didn't fit in. Every hero has to start somewhere. But you saw me for who I really was. You're already a hero. The only one left to convince is yourself. The world needs the Avengers. Now more than ever, you're in too late. Avengers, assemble. Why'd you smash the reactor cap? A lot of people died. A world divided. Its heroes outlawed. When evil eclipses hope, the only thing left 
is to fight back. War darkens the horizon. And it's going to take us all to stop Armageddon. If everything you saw is true, the end of the world is far closer than we'd like. In the future, we get attacked by a warrior race called the Kree. When will this Kree invasion take place, Clint? Oh, no. Clint! Don't die on me. You're a... We thought we were heroes, but we died as fools. Nick Fury. Some things never change. Who's the murder hobo? Katie? Clint? You never ventured beyond the store. You coward. Yeah, it's not one of those fun apocalypses. Oh my god! Ah, here, boy! Clint! Ah. Marvel's Avengers fans, we're excited to show you all of the updates you can expect on next generation consoles, available for upgrades starting March 18th at no additional cost. From the minute you boot up the game to getting back into the action after being down, faster load times make sure that you can get back to fighting aim as fast as possible. Higher resolution textures and translucency will bring a new level of detail to objects, characters, environments, and even particles. You'll see improvements across the board, including ambient occlusion quality, anisotropic filtering, and 60 FPS at 4K. Hulk smashes are even bigger with our improved destruction. Smashing through walls, doors, and enemies is always fun with the big green guy, and with improved destruction, the possibilities for Hulk epic smashes are endless. Not to be outdone, all of our heroes will see an improvement in their unique heroics across the board. Finally, teaming up as Earth's Mightiest Heroes has never been easier with cross-generation multiplayer, allowing you to continue to team up with friends within the same console family. Thanks for joining, and we're excited for you to experience this definitive superhero experience of Marvel's Avengers for console players starting March 18th at no additional cost.
What took you so long? We stumbled on this Tachyon project, and then Clint was gone too. It has to be connected. Our guest finally agreed to help. Clint? Kate, you need to destroy that place. Now! In the future, we get attacked by a warrior race called the Kree. With Tachyon disruptions, everyone who gets close to these things disappears. We have one shot at this. Great. Let's go get Hawkeye. Simple. I like it. Ready when you are, Iron Pants. Dr. Rappuccini, I read your proposal, and I must admit, I'm disappointed. You have the men. You have the tech. All you need now is me. Full-scale invasion. So, you get me the army. I'll get you the vibranium. Sincerely, Claw. Avengers, with me!
What is that thing? Modok, the mental organism designed only for killing, is a handsome and awe-inspiring figure. All adore him. What has happened to his face? Some claim Modok is evil, but people who aren't idiots know that he's a superior being and he knows what's best. I'm sorry. I don't know what came over me. He's also unstoppable. No one can defeat Modok in battle, physically or mentally. Anyone who claims they have done so is a liar. You struggle against the unstoppable tide of progress, Avengers. I can feel the power endorphins flowing through me. Does this thing have AC? Secure that super weapon at all costs. Cosmic energy is building up. Every second counts, people. Keep it moving. It's beautiful, isn't it? You're out of your depth, Avengers. Shutting you down, Monica. The world doesn't need a vengeance. Aim will save this world. I will save it. There is no end. This comes. You don't understand what that cube is capable of. I applaud your efforts to connect with your roots, but as a man who has seen three Black Panthers fall, I must warn you of a few things. Many eyes follow the path you are about to walk down.
Unauthorized personnel detected. Terminate with extreme prejudice. Tachyon readings are off the charts. It's only getting worse. Large aim mech ahead. Ten centuries is a long time to remain unconquered. We were bound to face a real challenge. I did not expect Ulysses' claw to be that challenge. Nor did I expect that the Avengers would be on their way here. Will they help us or hinder us? T'Challa is still a new king, but he is everything a Black Panther should be. Like his father before him. King T'Chaka was a great leader, an impeccable Black Panther. And yet, his death left deep scars on T'Challa's soul. How can you prepare for every threat when half of those threats live inside your own head? Fear of betrayal, of endangering those you love. Shuri was young when her father died but she felt the shift in her brother, and she learned a very different lesson. If she had challenged King Suyan, how different would Wakanda be? But Bast does not make mistakes. T'Challa is the Black Panther. He will never be alone, no matter how much he tries to guard his heart. If the unconquered realm is to have any hope of repelling this threat, the children of T'Chaka will have to work together. And I fear even that may not be enough.
have heard the name Claw once before. More than half a century ago. The gods were restless when the Elder Claw first arrived in Wakanda. They warned me that the bloodline would tear at the very fabric of our nation, starting with the Black Panther himself. But Wakanda remained unconquered. The name Claw was forgotten to history. The gods do not forget. I will not ignore their warning again. With an army of allies and advanced technology, Ulysses' claw is different. He is a son without a father, like the young man currently sitting on our throne. Hm. Where's the panther cowl and entertain snow advisors? T'Challa watched his father die at the hands of those he trusted most. He vowed to never let it happen again. But if he does not trust his people, Wakanda will fall. Uh, Claw promised to finish what his father started. The gods predict only one of them will succeed. My father came to your beautiful country when I was a child. He had heard about the mythical Vibranium. But the Black Panther said they had no Vibranium to give. He slit my father's throat. That Panther is dead. So you will have to do. You, and your people. You finally agree to accept help, and it is from outsiders. That is not like you. I am not accepting help. I am giving it. Then let me send teams to the corrupted sites. Take the Dora Milaje with you. Do something other than driving yourself headfirst into danger. I am not just a king on a throne. I am the Black Panther. Then show us you can be both. I will. Finish the job, boys! They are attacking the shield around Benindana! <laughs> Care to join us below this? You should embrace your spiritual side. Got a couple toys just for you. Enter. Here they come! With me! We need to evacuate the borderland. Your country crumbling at my feet. The whole place is coming down. Avengers, with me.
celebrates our one year anniversary month. We've come a long way since launch. You followed Kamala Khan on her path to becoming Miss Marvel. You picked up your bow to meet Kate Bishop. No! No! You welcomed Hawkeye back to the Avengers. Oh my god. You got creative with Temporal Assault. Oh, we got it! You survived the Red Room Takeover. <gasps> you stopped Monica in beating the odds. I'm like super scared she's gonna one shot, man. Don't one shot me. Oh, we got her. Woo. You worked together to defeat the Super Adaptoid in our first Omega level threat. <laughs> you journeyed to Wakanda and met the king. Yo! That skin is awesome. And we get to interpret these characters. Oh my god! Throughout the year, you've live streamed countless hours, snapped endless photo mode shots, and formed an unwavering community. To all the true believers out there, thank you. With you at our side, the future looks super heroic. Assemble on me! Dozen of them, one of me. What's that? Someone there? Just another day being Spider Man. Hey there, New York. 
Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man here. Wanted to give a bit of a life update since I'm sure you're wondering where I've been the past couple of weeks. <gasps> Come on, guys. I'm talking to my fans right now. Sorry about that. But yeah, I've been a little busy and I've sort of not really kind of been working with the Avengers. It's like a side hustle. It's hard taking down a multinational corporation. Especially when your team has been deemed outlaws in the public eye. But we still find time to enjoy ourselves outside of work. I've actually been able to do a lot more recreational stuff since I joined them. Here's a secret from yours truly. The Avengers? Surprisingly normal outside of bad guy butt kicking. They're like this big family of heroes. All working together and helping out, but still finding the time to have fun. Not that I've been goofing off. It's still serious work fighting alongside the Avengers. But you know how it is. Saving the city all the time. All by yourself. It gets kind of lonely. <sighs> I've met so many cool people now. I've been to so many wonderful places. And you know I'd never leave New York. You guys are always my number one. The Avengers are like no other friends I've ever had. It's been kind of great. Sorry, I I'm totally getting ahead of myself. Uh, let me back up a little bit. Start from the beginning. This is safe, right? Yeah, totally safe. What could possibly go wrong? Okay, I did not think this one through. PlayStation players, assemble your team of Avengers. Spider-Man is joining your roster. Our team has been hard at work crafting an all-new hero event for Marvel's Avengers exclusively for PlayStation. Uh, can I come in now? The high-flying wall crawler brings a completely new experience to the Avengers with an acrobatic combat style and a suite of new powers, making him a great way to see the entire Avengers initiative through a new mask. In the Spider-Man With Great Power Hero event, Peter Parker learns of a deadly plot and must partner with the Avengers to stop AIM from acquiring technology that could make their synthoid army unstoppable. Insistent on keeping his identity hidden, Spider-Man forms a tentative friendship with Miss Marvel and Black Widow while learning the new dynamic of working in a team. With a threat so grave that no superhero could face it alone, Spider-Man must team up with the Avengers to face his new challenge head-on. Our Peter Parker is in his early 20s. He is responsible to a fault, lighthearted but distant, and bears the burden of his double life as Spider-Man. A gifted chemical engineer, Peter is recruited for an internship with AIM alongside his smart and savvy classmate Liz Allen. However, Peter soon begins to suspect AIM of mistreating inhumans, leading him to seek out the Avengers' help as Spider-Man. When his quest to expose AIM uncovers the involvement of Alan Chemical, Liz becomes Spider-Man's eyes and ears and finds her loyalty to her family tested. Jumping right into the With Great Power Hero event is simple, whether you've been playing since launch or you've just picked up the game. Click the option from the war table within the Avengers Initiative. You don't need to play through the original Reassemble campaign or any previous operations to unlock Spider-Man as a playable hero. You'll be able to take on new Spidey-specific challenges and earn Spider-Man theme rewards to help you and your team in the fight. Why 
is my brother, always the one handing me my fate. He challenged our Uncle Sian, even though I had gotten there first. How different would our lives have been if T'Challa was the king of Wakanda, and I the Black Panther? Well, Queen Regent has a nicer ring to it. I was already kind of doing the job anyway. At least no one can accuse me of wasting time. Science does not recognize borders. We now have satellite laboratories to scan for any unusual sonic energy. Tony Stark has already made himself comfortable. I, we, will not be caught by surprise again. He did not mean to. But when T'Challa closed Wakanda's borders, he left Wakandans unsure of their relationship to their nation. It is a fracture I must now repair. If left to spread, who knows what could sneak through the cracks? Or who? Gameplay director for Marvel's Avengers. The new raid Discord and Sound is endgame content designed to challenge the highest level strike teams and is unlike anything you've encountered before in a game. With that said, there are some mild spoilers for the War for Wakanda expansion ahead, so you have been warned. As you and your friends descend into the Great Mound, you'll face elite enemies and puzzles that will require serious coordination to progress. Our story picks up directly after the events of War for Wakanda. The newly appointed Queen Regent Shuri informs Black Panther and the Avengers of a grave new threat. Corrupted vibranium has infested the Great Mound and is beginning to spread through the Wakandan jungle, revealing that the sonic monster Claw has returned. Our heroes decide to enter the Great Mound only to find it swarming with Claw's forces and a large sonic barrier preventing anyone from getting inside. With the fate of their country hanging in the balance, Wakanda's greatest warriors must join forces with Earth's mightiest heroes to stop the mammoth flaw from destroying Wakanda. Strike teams who brave the Great Mound's dangers will encounter all new threats never seen before in Marvel's Avengers. Teams will have to explore and solve cooperative puzzle rooms while defeating some of our most difficult encounters in an experience that will challenge both your mind and combat skills. You'll have to delve into the mound yourself to find all its secrets, but here's just a taste of what you can expect when we open the doors to the raid tomorrow. A new threat emerges in Wakanda that will test the strongest teams, so it's time to reassemble your friends and bring your A-game. In addition to bringing players our first ever raid, we're also making some major updates to the game systems. For the first time, Marvel's Avengers is raising the maximum power level that your heroes can achieve. Until now, heroes have maxed out at a power level of 150, but the changes coming in 2.2 will allow heroes to reach a new maximum of 175. There are a few ways to reach the new power level cap, but it won't be easy. You'll need dedication and persistence. Rewards from the Omega Level Threat Family Reunion and Discordant Sound Weekly Objectives can now be 10 levels higher, up to power level 150. 
As always, a fully boosted major artifact can grant you 10 extra levels. Once you've hit power level 160, you'll unlock the elite version of Discordant Sound, which rewards gear up to the new power level hard cap. Lastly, we're excited to say you no longer have to pick a single hero to gear up at a time as the weekly objectives to the Omega level threat and raid are now completable once per week with each hero. To help you max your characters as efficiently as possible, new weekly objectives for the Omega level threat family reunion and Discordant Sound will reward players with gear that will be guaranteed to be a higher power level until you hit the cap for those objectives. In addition to raising the power level cap, updates to the gear system are also on the way. Until now, gear has only been upgradable by 10 power levels. Starting tomorrow, our new system will allow you to upgrade any piece of gear that starts at power level 100, an epic rarity or higher an unlimited number of times until it reaches the power level cap. If you've been holding on to an underpowered piece of gear with the perfect rolls for your build, now you can ensure it stays usable as you make your way to the new max power level. We're also simplifying the way that you use resources to upgrade gear. Starting with 2.2, the only resources you'll need to upgrade a piece of gear are fragments, upgrade modules, and an unwanted higher level piece of gear. The cost to upgrade a piece of gear will increase the higher the target power level. Finally, we're introducing an exciting new way to collect and earn some of our coolest cosmetics with our brand new shipment system. Shipments will contain a randomized collection of cosmetics and resources that update on a rotating basis, with any duplicates of cosmetics you've already unlocked converted into fragments. You'll be able to buy shipments with earnable units or earn a free one every day through multiplayer play. There's no guesswork though. You'll be able to see everything in a shipment before you spend your hard-earned units on it. Best yet, opening enough shipments in a cycle will guarantee a top-tier reward. Check out our patch notes on the blog at playavengers.com for full details on these and other exciting changes. In my timeline, Asgard has fallen. The gods said the end of days would cast the Ten Realms into ice and darkness. Instead, it was fire and blood. Odinson never returned from Earth, and without his son to protect Asgard from outside influence, the Allfather went mad. Mjolnir chose me to take up the mantle. But it was too late. Odin had locked the Allmother away and declared those loyal to her as his enemy. And if he had to destroy Asgard to root out rebellion, so be it. I was used to fighting battles. I was used to facing down darkness. But this... Even I had to admit, I needed help. So, I made a deal 
with the last person in the Ten Realms I would ever turn to. My father always said, if a man can't smile without making you uneasy, that man is rotten to the core. But sometimes you have to make compromises. And compromises have a price. I didn't want to pay, but you can't trick the god of mischief. Well, I guess that's one way to do it. <laughs> Avengers, follow me! This must be it. Watch your sight lines. Get ready. How was Aim hiding all this? Ghost from the past. No unauthorized personnel in the extraction lab. Modok! You can't stop the progress. We can't let her leave with Modok! During the Cold War, there was a theory that one agent at the right place, at the right time, with the right skills, could be more effective than an army. That agent was the Winter Soldier. That agent was me. My military career began as Captain America's sidekick. Steve was four years my senior and everything I wanted to be. The war had other plans. And so did the Soviets. They gave me a metal arm and took away everything I was. But Nat, she made me remember what it was to feel human. We knew it was forbidden, but I loved her more than anything. When they found out, they put me back on ice. I lived only in waking nightmares as the Winter Soldier, lost between years of sleep. It was hard, waking up alone to a new world. Even worse after A-Day. I couldn't find Nat. And Steve. Steve was gone. I just wanted to do good. For him. I failed. Monica Rappuccini reactivated the Winter Soldier. Two years I spent being experimented on. Assassinating people. Abducting Inhumans for aims. Research. Sometimes I think I should have never woken up. But I'm really glad I did. Avengers! Move out! Marvel's fan favorite anti-hero, the Winter Soldier, is joining the Avengers roster. The Winter Soldier is a force to be reckoned with and has an all-new set of moves and abilities, and a custom mission chain. You're welcome. 
The Crystal Dynamics dev team has taken great care bringing Bucky Barnes to life. His look, fighting abilities, and narrative have been crafted in a way that is faithful to his comic origins, yet unique to our game. Bucky Barnes made his comic debut all the way back in Captain America Comics No. 1 in March of 1941 as Cap's teen sidekick. Their legendary Nazi fighting exploits continued in comics well into the 1950s. Bucky met a seemingly permanent demise when a bomb on a plane he and Rogers were attempting to defuse exploded above frigid Arctic waters, killing Bucky and freezing Cap in the wreckage. Bucky was resurrected as the Winter Soldier in the 2004 issue of Captain America No. 1, written by Ed Brubaker. Thought long dead, Bucky was revived by the Evil Department X, a covert Soviet agency responsible for training Russian super soldiers and the deadly assassins of the Red Room. He was outfitted with a bionic arm and brainwashed, transforming him into a ruthless secret assassin known as the Winter Soldier. After the A-Day disaster, Bucky is distraught by the loss of Steve Rogers. Maria Hill reaches out to Bucky and gives him new purpose, finding and rescuing missing Inhumans. However, he still feels he needs answers for Cap's death. Monica uses this to set a trap, capturing and reactivating him as the Winter Soldier, trying to weaponize his mind control protocols to harness MODOK's frightening powers. Bucky is rescued by the Avengers, but he is initially hesitant to join them, knowing that Monica's protocols are still out there and could be reactivated at any time. After Natasha uncovers the possible location of the protocols, Bucky teams up with the Avengers to ensure he will never be controlled again. Bucky Barnes is one of the oldest and most compelling characters in Marvel history. The ultimate anti-hero, his deadly skills are the stuff of legend, and his redemptive rise as a true hero weaves a story unlike any other. Now the Winter Soldier has arrived in Marvel's Avengers, bringing exciting combat, an all-new mission chain, and awesome cosmetics. It's time to gather your friends and jump into Marvel's Avengers. Activate the Winter Soldier and join the fight when Patch 2.7 drops on November 29th. Marvel's ultimate anti-hero, the Winter Soldier, is coming to Marvel's Avengers, and we're here to give you the lowdown on how to make the most of his abilities. The Winter Soldier was once Bucky Barnes, Captain America's faithful sidekick. After he was seemingly killed in the explosion that left Cap frozen in ice, Bucky was resurrected by the shadowy Soviet covert agency, Department X. The Soviets gave Bucky a powerful bionic arm and trained him to be an expert in hand-to-hand -hand combat and marksmanship, unleashing his deadly combination of power and precision on the world as the Winter Soldier. Freed from the sway of his captors, the Winter Soldier now relies on his former training to fight for justice. A powerhouse damage dealer, he excels in both close-up and personal brawling and medium-ranged marksmanship and his customizable combat kit sets him apart from other heroes, making him a versatile and fresh addition to the Marvel's Avengers roster. Let's break down what makes Bucky distinct from the rest of the Avengers by diving into his unique suite of combat abilities. Bucky can modify his base abilities by turning on his intrinsic ability, Steel Forged Tenacity. This is charged by parrying damage, leading to a customizable defensive boost. Red Star Rising, Bucky's intrinsic overcharge, triggers an area of affected damage explosion good for clearing small mobs, with a time-based bonus that gives increased moderate armor and increased melee damage. Winter Soldier has a series of awesome intrinsic attacks, including a light sprint called Glinting Blade, which deals damage with his knife, and his heavy sprint, Explosive Entrance, a powerful slam that sends enemies flying. Bucky's natural fighter light combo is a flurry of punches along with a kick and knife combo finisher. With the So Below signature air attack, slam into the ground, creating a shockwave that staggers nearby enemies. Send enemies flying with the heavy combo finisher, a metal arm bionic ground pound. 
Bucky's heavy power attack, Buckshot, can be upgraded to a combination ranged attack that gives you access to various modes of his rifle, including fully automatic fire, high-powered piercing rounds, and his grenade launcher. Winter Soldier's ranged attack, Suppressive Fire, blasts three high-damage rounds. When charged up, he fires a single high-powered round that can pierce armor or even multiple enemies at once. The Winter Soldier can cover ground quickly with his grappling hook and wall run abilities. Bucky calls his support heroic Soldier Tech Nonsense. A remnant of the tech department X gave him. He doesn't know or care what its real name is or how it works, just that the personal stealth field it generates gives him an advantage in a fight. Airstrike is Bucky's assault heroic, which allows him to call in an airstrike to set a target that drops multiple bombs in succession on the battlefield. And when the battle isn't going your way, it's time to hit the Berserk button and unleash the Winter Soldier's room-clearing ultimate heroic protocol override. Perform a bionic slam that stops enemies in their tracks and marks enemies for assassination within a 40-meter range around Bucky. This allows Bucky and his allies to instantly take down enemies without having to stun them. In addition, his melee damage increases and he is granted a new knife-light combo attack. The Winter Soldier has arrived and he brings his powerful and devastating skill set to Marvel's Avengers. Whether you want to pick apart enemies from a distance or jump into the fray and engage in close quarters combat, the Winter Soldier is a master assassin with a customizable combat kit that makes him a versatile and nearly unstoppable addition to the Avengers roster. Your orders are to join us and experience his exciting story of vengeance and redemption when Winter Soldier makes his Marvel's Avengers debut in Patch 2.7, available on November 29. Avengers touching down. Let's move out. Behold my power! Is AIM keeping in humans here? No one shall stand in my way! I've only grown stronger! It's me. Hi, it's Sandra. We just wanted to thank you guys so much for being with us on this journey since day one. I don't know if you remember, but that very first announcement was a really long time ago. And ever since I met Miss Marvel in those scripts, she's meant 
so, so much to me. And I know this game means a lot to a lot of people. Miss Marvel is so genuinely herself. She loves with her whole heart. She's excited, she's infectious. And if you're around her, you're gonna be stoked too. Some of my favorite memories were filming with Brian George, who played Abu. I remember one day we were filming that scene where we were going into A-Day and Kamala was really nervous about presenting her comic book because she didn't want to be different. And it's just such a beautiful scene that ended up in some tears. And I remember we were really in there and you know, we were crying and <laughs> um, we're hugging each other and then our head cameras get hooked. And as we struggled, our Velcro kind of got stuck together and then the head cam operators ran on and we're like, don't move. It was funny. Also, every single scene where Brian George mentioned ice cream, that was great. Um, only because I like ice cream a lot and um, it made me hungry. There'll be ice cream, eh? <laughs> oh, and best of all, no boys, so lots of fun. <laughs> <laughs> so more than anything, I hope that your big takeaway from this game is to eat a lot of ice cream. Just kidding. <laughs> sure, eat ice cream, whatever. But really, I hope you had fun. All of us, from Crystal Dynamics to Square Enix, to Blind Light to every single company, person, and computer involved. Thank you, and we hope you guys had fun. Awkward. <laughs> uh, do I really have to say goodbye? I can't say it. I won't say it. I, you say it. Ugh. I can't, I can't, I can't. No, 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 not gonna do it because <laughs> Okay, I think I'm ready. Okay, Jarvis, you know what I need, right? Let's gather around the fire. Nighty night, sweetheart. What smart, handy guy fixed you up? All right. That was me. Teamwork makes the dream work. Looks spectacular. Good job, me.
thank you for an incredible two plus years. To our community of more than 16 million players, you've been with us through two operations, the War for Wakanda expansion, new missions, six hero launches, more than 70 updates, and over 800 comics and MCU-inspired outfits. We've loved seeing your incredible photo mode shots and watching you stream your favorite moments. Oh my God! We'd also like to extend a special thank you to our awesome community moderators. Thank you for joining us on the ride. Seriously, you're the best.